Hey guys, what's up? I'm Mike Levitsky, and today I'm reacting to August Burns Reds drummer Matt Greiner. The track will be Paramount, and this is the drum playthrough off of August Burns Reds channel. It's kind of hard to say. Uh, I am a drummer and musician. I've been playing music for about 30 years, and in these videos, I pretty much just do them live. I hit record, I watch the video, stop it along the way, give you a little bit of analysis about what the drummer's doing, things that I'm thinking about, and uh, just try to have a good time watching other drummers play music with you guys. So if you enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more content just like this, and you can drop some suggestions of what I should react to next in the, uh, in the comments below. Uh, before we go into the reaction, you can grab $25 in Bitcoin when you deposit your first $100 using the Voyager app. The link is below. I love Voyager. It's the best on-ramp for cryptocurrencies that I have found, and uh, I, I think it's great. So that's why I'm recommending it to you. Uh, with that being said, let's jump into Matt's performance. So I have seen August Burn Red. Actually, I haven't seen them. Uh, I've listened to some of their, their tracks, uh, a few of them, like a long, long, long time ago. And uh, I got really into their Christmas album like years and years and years ago, but I haven't heard Matt play in a long time and I've never seen him play. So I'm excited about this and uh, it should be good. Here we go. Nice delay on the guitar. All right, real quick, let's get a, a, a look at the kit. I always like to look at the kit on this channel. Some of you guys might not like that, but too bad, it's my channel. All right, so a uh, five piece kit, unless he's got a floor tom down here that we can't see. Lots of symbols, two China symbols, so smaller China symbol here, a larger one here. Uh, uh, some kind of a bell over his ride symbol. He's got a ride symbol, two crashes, and then uh, maybe a splash symbol and maybe some kind of a stack down there, I'm not sure. Looks like he's playing Zildjian symbols. Uh, which are uh, great symbols. There's, there's a lot of great symbol companies out there, and Zildjian's one of them. So it looks like 10, 12, 14 inch floor tom with a 14 inch uh, snare drum. And of course, uh, we can see that he's playing a double bass drum pedal right down there. So, awesome. Man. It's like he's running. Really clean. Yep, splash symbol. Halftime breakdown. <laughs> All right, well, that was a really interesting transition. All right, so we're doing 16 note bass stuff. So we're going to dig it, 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 one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two, right? And then he does this fill and he transitions to almost, I think it's a triplet bass thing. Let's find out. Yeah. All right, so now we're going one, two, triple, 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 right? But this was an interesting thing that he did here. He's breaking the triplets up into um, two note groupings. And so you have the triplet moving kind of uh, over the bar line. It gives you this weird sort of metric modulation-ish type feel. So like right here, so that part, because he's playing triple, 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 triple. But if I break that up, it's triple, 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 triple. So the 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 snare ends up being on the trip lit pa 
trip, lit, pa, trip, lit, pa. It gives it a really, really interesting feel. Now we're in full triplet. Da 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 da. One two three. 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 All right, kind of like a triplet blast beat thing. Now back to the 16 note. No, no, still triplet. Wow. So he's playing that single. That's interesting because if I was gonna play that, uh, I would just play double. So I play da 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 da, and I just double one hand. But he's playing it with with singles, which means to go da 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 da, and so it makes the sticking or the footing, I guess, if you would, move back and forth. This is a great pause, man. This is this should be the thumbnail right here. I should be like with him doing that face. That'd be good. All right. Anyway, let's continue on. All right, back to 16 notes. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Man, that's really cool. This thing right here is like a just a giant bell. That sounds really neat. So this is a larger bell and then a smaller bell. So it'd be a lower pitched and then a higher pitched sound here. Really cool. Okay, so this thing that he played right here is uh it's like accenting every third 16 note. So it's like one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a and it gives it this really cool kind of like modulated sound even though you're staying in time. Four E and a one and a three and a three E and a four E and a yeah. I'll try to count it for you. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. Yeah. Man, the guitar players are really good too. I'm really focusing my ear on on mass playing, but wow, the guitar work is great. Ha <laughs> ha. It looks like he's having fun. Really nice patterns on the on the kick drum. Yeah, really good. Really creative. All right, back to the triplet. No, he didn't. So this fill. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Trying to count through that. My goodness, listen to this how that's crazy. I got no idea what's going on there. <laughs> I'd have to stop that, play it in slow motion, and then write it out, and then figure out what on earth was happening right there. Uh, I bet that took them quite a while to work all that out with the guitars and him on the drums so that it was all uh, lined up with there. But really cool, really intricate, really enjoyed that. Oh my goodness. So much to remember. Yeah, like the guitar part, man. And then he's going back and forth like this full groove, and then like a halftime thing. Now catching the accent. So good. (laughs) 
I can play that beat. <laughs> That's a rock game. My devil bass chops are not up to par to play anything like this, man. Oh my goodness. So good. Oh, that was nice. He likes that fill. Alright, alright, alright. Let's do a slow mo real quick. Let's break that fill down because he's played it like two or three times. So we're gonna do half speed and let's go through and figure out what it is. Oh, it's just snare tom kick, snare tom kick, floor tom. Yeah, that's actually not, not it's just a triplet. Snare tom kick, snare tom kick. Snare tom kick, snare tom kick. Oh, then there's a flam. So it's snare tom kick, snare tom kick, flam kick, snare tom kick, snare tom kick, flam kick, snare tom kick, snare tom kick, flam kick. If I had my drum set, I'd play it for you. But uh, super simple. So that's one fill you can take from Matt Griner uh, that maybe some of us or all of us could probably play because it's not that hard. Uh, but it sounds great the way that he placed it in there. So let's listen to it at full speed. And then he, then he doubled the speed at the end. I like how he goes up the toms too here. So usually tom fills go down, but then he goes coming back around before he does that triplet fill. And it's not triplets, it's based in 16 notes. That's why it sounds like it's over the bar. Because it's a three note fill, but it's uh, based in 16 notes. All right, nice job, Matt. Nice job, man. Good stuff. All right. I did, I saw you laughing during that. I sure did, brother. All right, uh, great. So, Paramount by Matt Griner. Uh, he's a great drummer, really creative. And uh, the parts that he was playing were so intricately linked to the guitar parts. Uh, he really plays to the song and uh, did a lot of uh, just great sounding fills, uh, creative fills, nice use of the cymbals, great double bass chops. Oh my goodness, just some of, and it's super clean. Like everything he played was, was really, really, really clean. And uh, so enjoyed that, enjoyed your performance, Matt. If you liked this video, if you liked this reaction, give this a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more content just like this, and uh, I'll continue checking out your guys' favorite drummers and uh, their, their tunes that they're playing on and give you my reaction and just enjoy watching drums with you guys. I love watching drums with you guys. So uh, if you check right over there, you'll find a, a couple more videos that YouTube's gonna recommend to you of mine that you might enjoy watching. And uh, thanks for hanging out with me today. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.